switch to unabated gang wars. One officer down, so I guess you're all screwed, because the NCPD will not let that go. Got another right, blackout in another Santo session. Domingo. Netrunners are at it again, poking holes in the power. Let's see what V's up to. Tonight is Lieutenant Sarah Kokoski, spokeswoman for the NCPD. Hi there, welcome to the show. Uh, hello, Ziggy. Thanks for having me. I hope you made it to the studio without. Yeah, we'll go find Judy. Let's see what Judy's up to. In northern Europe, the humanitarian crisis has worsened. Refugees from flooded regions in Belgium and the Netherlands continue to pour into Slovenia. Snow shadows are in force. Humanitarian efforts, nearly 60 people have been killed. Have we found heaven on Earth? Permanent human settlement on Antarctica is celebrating 10 years today. A wealth of natural resources hidden under the ice has spurred on the continent's rapid economic development. Though some environmental degradation has occurred as a result, inhabitants of the South Pole are still enjoying life as Antarctica's first dollhouse was recently opened. But perhaps most appealing to locals and newcomers alike is the astonishingly low crime level. Antarcticans enjoy a murder rate of only 70 per 100,000 residents. Thank you for watching N54 News. We'll see you next time. Oh, she's excited about that. She just started dancing. Jeez. Yeah. Alright, let me go get my imaginary friend. Take the car ride over here and go see Judy. Johnny, did you see what happened? Something feels off here. You don't say. I don't mean the wreck, I mean the run. City's most courteous chauffeur up and drives away from the scene of an accident. You know, that's twice I've done this now, and he didn't say beep beep motherfucker. Maybe they, uh, maybe they got rid of that. Hopefully that didn't put a scratch on it. I kind of promised I wouldn't.
Wait, is that the Delamain? That the asshole that hit me? Girl Judy. All right, got some crap. Before. Got a good memory for faces. Me too. We're closed right now. Need to talk to Punch and Judy. She and her den. Yep. Take the stairs down. I'll let Judy know you're coming. Sorry about the coughing. Just don't let me catch you messing around, okay? Never. You will never catch me. Judy's friend. Stop telling every joy toy you need to come here. The hell I'm supposed to do with them all? I don't. Must be our rep. Girls need help, they come here. Last time I checked, we weren't running a shelter. You so concerned about strays? Go take care of your guests. Suze, we're not done here. Oh yeah, we fucking are. It sounded pretty done. 
What's up, Judy? Hey, Ben. You just don't give up, do you? Got nothing more to say to each other. Thought I... What was that all about? Everyone in this city lives in their own goddamn bubble. And either you fly high or sink into quicksand. Susie seems to know what she wants. She your boss? You come all this way just to play who's who at the mocks? Yeah. Listen, have you seen Evelyn? Need to talk to her. It's important. Why? So you can make her your scapegoat for your train wreck of a heist. Yeah. You seem to know how the heist went. Meaning you did talk to her. I know how you fucked up. Got all your Doombas killed like a real pro. Yeah? Caught some lead myself, too. Boo hoo. Occupational hazard for you, Mercs. Do this for fun, talking around in circles. Trying to make this simple. Just tell me where she is. Why can't you? I don't trust you. That's simple. Sure, I took a risk. We all did. But it was Evelyn who gave it to us in the first place. She knew what this was from the start. <coughs> Fine. Looks like we're all in this piss pot together. But you're desperate. The writing's on your face. Yeah? Excuse me? I came here with a simple question. You're the one making me desperate if I am. Maybe instead of judging, you could just tell me where she is. All right, enough. Get lost. You care so much. Find clouds. Look there. And where's clouds? Sig case on my desk got the address. Just take it and go. Mega tower. <laughs> Luxurious. What's clouds? A dollhouse. But can't say I like your chances if you don't know that much. Read the streets. Evelyn's there. You know this, or are you guessing? Saw it in the tarot. Now ghost before I call the girls. <laughs> You're slightly bitchier than I'm used to. Yeah, fuck you too, bitch. Hold on, a dollhouse? Evelyn, a regular there? Or a drone? To say, or... Hang on, I'm missing a gun.
Ah, they moved it. staring at. Got something to say? Say it. Know what happened to Evelyn Parker? Why are you asking me? You talked to Judy about her already. Sure, but you're the boss. Might know something more. Evelyn jumped the mock ship a long time ago. And anyone not a mox is not my damn problem. Yeah, fair enough. Forget Evelyn. What a Admit it. This is about Judy's virtues, isn't it? Good shit, if I say so myself. Nobody can hold a candle to Judy. Cuts virtues like they were diamonds. Damn straight. Name's V. And what? No pleased to meet you? Hm. I'm truly honored to meet you. You got any biz? Call me. Pockets. Me? It's been a long time. Okako Okada, the lady of Westbrook Estate. When you find a moment, come see me. We must settle our accounts for Sandra Dorset. You did quite well, you and that friend of yours. Until then. Feel so good. What would you recommend? Poor Jerry. Did Maggie ask you to sleep on the couch again? Yeah, that's going in the troubleshoot log. Oh, 
awful lot of tiger claws here. Way I see it, only thing waiting for you here is getting off or getting off. Place your bets. Get a picture with my imaginary friend here. There we go. What have I missed this time? Enlighten me. The brain dance chick is hiding something. No coincidence we already saw two tiger claws. They must control the building. Arasaka and the tiger claws are in bed together. Go figure. Every corp plays dirty, except the streets are more than that. They're filth. So the corps leave it to the... Surprised? No, I mean, if Evelyn wanted to disappear, especially from Arasaka, she could have done better. This whole situation's bent over, cheeks spread wide. Someone's in a great mood. Not every day a half-brain dead chick drags me around a cat house on a wild war chase. So having a grand old time. Like you don't like whores. You think Judy's lying? Why? Little something called intuition, V. Ever heard of it? Oh, so what you meant to say was you're full of shit. Got it.
What's up, bitch? Welcome to Clouds, where we know what you're looking for. Would you care to jack into the terminal? You realize personal links aren't secure, right? Could get hit with malware straight to my core, into paying an arm and a leg for a ripper dock. We need data from your core to pair you up with the doll. Meaning a biometric scan? Just that. If anything goes wrong, you can lodge a complaint. But that's never happened. Well, sign me up. All right, let's do this. This will be a live session, so events may take an unexpected turn. But don't quit if you feel uncomfortable. You could miss out on something truly remarkable. If you feel unready to handle what comes next, you can interrupt the session immediately. Now for your safe word. Samurai. And saved. Now bear with me a moment. Scanning your personal profile. You should see compatible dolls in just a second. matches interesting is that normal or who can say what is normal you're clearly a unique person with unique tastes our system can handle it in other so words no you're be? not normal angel or sky rather go with sky i couldn't have chosen better myself now for the payment and you'll venture into the clouds. There you go. And the payments come through. The entire floor is open to you if you wish to wind down first. Sky awaits you in booth nine. Disconnect, please. Is that it? <clears throat> We have a strict no weapons policy here at Clouds. Please deposit any and all hazardous items with me. You asshole. Only two willing to spread their legs for you. Sad. Go eat a dick, Johnny. You won't find any use for weapons inside. Thank you. We hope you enjoy your stay. Lord knows Johnny would never uh, frequent whores and prostitutes and such. He's a good boy. Guess that makes you a real deviant. Would have had more choices if I didn't have a certain brain parasite. Hi. The bitch. I'm Sky. And you must be... Valerie? V. Just V. Only people who know me real well can use my real name. Okay, then. V. Well, looks like this will be interesting. So, V. You're dying. Looking for someone named Evelyn Parker. Used to work here. Know her? Know where she is? You need answers. That's clear. Just not the ones you think you need. Asked you a simple question. Evelyn Parker. Not the most important thing you're looking for, is she? I can smell your fear. You're afraid of something else. Yeah, spiders. Think you know me well. Okay. Tell me what I'm so afraid of. Spiders. It's something you don't talk about. Everybody's entitled to secrets. Got my own with good reason, too. Say it. Say it out loud. Not for me, but for yourself. Spiders. 
had a true friend once. Now he's gone. Soon I'll be gone too. Except, won't have anyone by my side. Everything you need, you already carry inside you. What, John? You're scared because you've given up on your dreams. What happened to becoming the best in all of Night City? Still want to be the best. Never gave up on that goal. Chances of getting there are starting to look pretty slim, though. Just want the world to know I was here. That I mattered. Instead of a dream, you're living a nightmare. You're afraid of being erased, as if you never existed. Or is it just the fear of becoming someone else? Different? Death is death is death. You're gone. Game over. You can't know that for certain. Even if you've been there and back. Believe me, I've seen it. And it's fucking boring. You haven't stopped grieving since. Or for what's to come. What's past is past. I'm over it. You're in denial, don't you see? Would it change things even by a hair if I wasn't? <sighs> so what now? You find out what it is you need to do. Which is? You gonna tell me? You've never backed down from anything in your life. Even when you maybe should've. You go through Night City knowing a stray bullet could end you while hailing a cab. But that's never stopped you from taking action. Going. I keep up with everything that's changing. You have been keeping up. You've made an impact. Not a single thing in this world isn't in the process of becoming something else. Likewise, you never look back. If you got a kid. Thanks, uh, for all this. Jeez, don't even feel like getting up. Few do, but everything has its end. This was 500 bucks. Samurai. Oh, what's going on? Goddamn thing threw me out. Need to talk to you. Talk? You pulled the emergency brake, ripped me out just to talk? What happened? I do something wrong? A lot of things have been going on in my head lately. But this was different, refreshing. That's what we do at Clouds. I get why people come here, come back. But I need something else. Evelyn Parker. What do you know about her? Not much. Everyone's got their own booths, their own problems, their own little bubbles. It's a fragile ecosystem. People like you, Vargin, violate it, try to rearrange. No. I need this info. Name your price. Fuck you, your Eddies and that girl of yours. I could get fired for doing something like this. I'll make it worth your while. All right, fine. Hand it over and get out before you land me in the shit. 
First, tell me what you know about Evelyn. Fine. Heard a customer did a number on her. But that's all I know. Shit like that happens around here way more often than anybody'd care to admit. You ought to ask Tom. Two of them were inseparable, gossiping for hours on end. A customer attacked her? I guess. I don't know. Real mess that was. Security barged in, handled it. Things went silent. You don't go around asking questions here. Better off not seeing, not hearing. Keeping your head down. Where did it happen? Her booth. Told you. She was with a client. Can I just stand there or tell me a number? Eleven. This booth occupied now? Nah. I think it's been out of order since... Um... Need to get inside that booth somehow. Yeah? And do what? None of your biz. Can you open it or not? Sure. Just don't bother me again. Ever. Talk to Tom. Who's Tom? A doll, like the rest of us. What do you think? An XBD star? Where will I Maybe. find him? VIP area. Booth 2, I think. Thanks. See? You turned out to be useful after all. Let's take a look, shall we? Blood. Fresh, not too much. Put it to a wound rather than a kill. Hmm. What's this? Well, the client wasn't the one who flew off the handle. Something bitter in the ass. What do you think? Cyberpsychosis? Sounds crazy, but she could have been remotely hacked. A net runner? Weird. See that? See what? Nothing there. Exactly. Should be a port right there for the doll to jack into. They rip it out? Wonder why. Up, army. Not bad, but it would be much better, Rio. I would eat those thighs. What do you mean, real? She's all ones and zeros. Do you mean I can ask her to do anything? Literally anything? I can't get in? What's that mean? I'm here every motherfucking week. You're not authorized to access the VIP area. Oh, yes, I am. No, sir, you're not. You can take it up with the manager. No, dog. I'm taking it up with you. Here, now. You got any idea who I am? Is there a problem? This gonk don't understand that I've got a right to be in there. From what I can see, your VIP membership has been revoked. Say what now? 
Please stay calm, sir. Or we're gonna have to escort you outside. Shortage of wise asses. I'll see. You're going back upstairs? In a minute. I need to piss first. Uh. You're right, Bunny. Second floor is for VIP customers only. You better keep it short and sweet. Two brainwashed sex zombies in a single day is too much, even for me. Hi. Um, I think something might have gone wrong here. Not really sure, uh... I don't have your details? Sorry, no idea what I'm supposed to do. You sure you're VIP? Relax. You don't need any data, don't need any deeds. I'm not a customer. Here to talk. To you, specifically. Not to be with a doll. Tom, is that it? Uh-huh. Need to get in touch with Evelyn Parker. It's important. You and me both. Tried calling her a bunch of times. No luck. Try again. Mean to say she's not here? She had an accident. Needed to go to a special clinic in Osaka. Or Oslo. I think it was Oslo. For a new faceplate. That accident involved a client, did it? Found blood in her booth. Ah. Uh, you know, shit like that happens here sometimes. And everyone's cool with that. We get new implants, recovery leave, and, well, sometimes even a payout. Now that I think about it, it is weird she went away so far. Tell you herself she was skipping town? Nah, just didn't show up for work. Wasn't picking up either, so I asked Woodman what was up. Told me she left, like I said. Where can I find this Woodman? Probably got his feet up in the back office. Except it's off limits to customers. Woodman. Who is he? Mr. Forrest. But everybody calls him Woodman. Never really known why. Okay, Mr. Forrest then. What's his thing? He's kind of like our caretaker. Finds new talent, deals with ugly situations. Got it. Could it?
it be Woodman finally shed some light on this shit show? Man can only dream. The skull sponges in these dolls. Ugh. That's what they should be replacing. Alright, let me, uh... This is a stealth section. IV is going to be styling after this mission. Left or first. Could have had more than one. All her shit's in it, though. Must have left in a hurry.
Have you ever heard of Jotaro Shobo? He's one of the T-Claws. Yeah, I've heard. A fucking psycho. Like Looks for me. What's that? Evelyn's jacket. Crumbled like a tissue. Must have been here a while. That's all pretty, honey. But so what? Assos like Shobu have been on my blacklist before I heard of him. The Mox blacklist is more powerful. It actually means something. I'll believe it when I see his rotting, stinking corpse. That's unpleasant. What's up, Woodman? Bro, no clients allowed in here. Fortunately, I'm not one. Well, dear, close the door on the way out, would ya? As you can see, I'm very busy. Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. Got nobody working here by that name. But she used to. What happened to her? Probably did what all the dolls try to do. Found a unicorn to set her up for life. Ah, you could do better. Try Roxy over a booth, too. Same heart shaped ass. Behavioral chip will do the rest. Won't feel any difference. Look to me like a reasonable man. I think we can work something out. And you look to me like a psycho bitch who's never been ghosted by her bill or bow before. But go on. I'm listening. You sit here in this dank hole you probably call your office and think you've got it made, don't you? Congrats! You read minds better than our own fucking AI. 
Someone get this girl a job. Ever stop to think who's behind the Tiger Claw puppets you call your bosses? Tiger Claw bosses have got their own bosses, in case you didn't know. You're just too small to see them. <laughs> oh, because you're such a big shot. Let's just say, a certain member of the Arasaka clan wouldn't be pleased if he knew something bad happened to Evelyn, and that you're the one responsible. All right, fine. I'll lay it on you straight. Girl you're looking for, Parker. She ain't here. Tell me something I don't know. Like, where is she? Think you know how things work around here. But you don't know shit. Dolls aren't here to give you pleasure and satisfaction out of the goodness of their soul. They're workers. Their job's to generate profit. Evelyn, stop pulling profit. No denying that, sadly for her. Saw what she did to the client. She gets spiked or something? Whatever or whoever fried her circuits, it came from outside, I submit. They played their deck like a virtuoso. Her chip was fucking rot. Believe you me, we tried to fix it. Didn't even come close. They common? These kind of accidents? Ever use tech that never broke? Didn't think so. Behavioral chip splits you right down the middle. Some people plain lose their minds. Sounds and for right. everyone that does, there's a dozen in line to replace them. This you talking it out straight? What happened to Evelyn? Got an order from up high to recycle her. You killed her? No. I found a ripper doc who was willing to take a look. Yeah, he said he knew something or other. You invested your own eddies to help poor, unprofitable Evelyn? <laughs> Please. <laughs> you got me. Ripper's the one who paid me. For a broken doll. People got all kinds of kinks. Trust me. I know. Considering where I work. Fingers is a real specimen, though. Got all the fetishes. Even the ones you've never heard of. I'm sure he found her a nice niche. <laughs> the Ripper. Name and address. Don't know a last name. Don't fuck with me. I'm not. Goes by fingers. Clinic's in some godforsaken alley up on Jig Jig Street. Wanna find Evelyn? Look there. And don't come back here. Ever. While you're at it, take the elevator. The quicker you're out of here, the better. Dark fingers on Jig Jig Street. Sounds like a co-ed's wet dream. Yeah. May take your weapons. Why, thank you. A pleasant day to you. The next time you have that urge for clouds, don't wait. Charm this place in that slimy subterranean kind of way. See, her opinion about dollhouses hasn't changed. Oh, but it has. 
Before, I wouldn't have touched one with a ten-mile pole. Now I'm thinking a fire'd really make this place shine. Think Fingers has got her? Think we'll find her there? V, if I could see that far, I wouldn't be a fucking ghost on a chip in a corpse's head right now. Eh, yeah, fair enough. in any condition to find help. Decommission before we learn how to rip the chip out. Wanted me dead. Said so yourself. Made it pretty clear since that I changed my mind. Want you to live now. Asked you already. What the hell you want from me? I got a get out of jail free card. I'd be a fucking fool not to take advantage. See, me and Arasaka, we got a half-century-old score neat settling, and I plan to do it. That's what I need you for. But why? Fighting for some dated ideal? Pursuing a personal vendetta? You don't need to know. Here to get me from point A to point B. Fair enough. Listen, I know things. Where we can save your life, who can help us do that? You'll get rid of the chip. I'll smash Sokka. Win-win, kid. Soul Killer's what we need, and Makoshi's how we grab it. Okay, so this Makoshi, what is it, exactly? Okay, basics. If you're jacked in, cruising the net, Arasaka can use Soul Killer, an AI, to trap, fry, and pack away your psyche, your mind, and your soul. Following so far? Yeah, seen the memories. Did a real number on you. Okay, seems we've got a few more things to broach than I thought, but that'll come later. Anyway, when Soul Killer fries, roasts, and boils you, you die, but the contents of your mind get copied to an engram first. Sure. <clears throat> That's how you became a construct. Exactly. Now, Makoshi's the place Soul Killer operates out of, where it stores its victims' engrams. Come on. Come on, you got more to say, so just say it. Fifty years back. Ops on the human mind. Makoshi was the sole place on Earth where they did anything like that. <laughs> Bet it still is today. Telling you, all roads lead there. It's where we'll settle our biz. You yours, me mine. And, uh, how you plan to smash Arasaka this time? Got another nuke tucked away? Yeah. This time, bombs named Alt Cunningham. I'm supposed to know who that is. Not yet, but you will once we find what we need. 
For now, we got no time to lose. Need to get inside, Makoshi. Fine, fine, fine. It was neat that, uh, that all his knowledge is still up to date. Like, it's been 50 years, and, like, maybe that Makoshi's not there anymore, and somebody else is doing it. But nope, sure enough. Grudges or forget promises just because someone's having a shitty day. Sure went and proved it. Called me up just to say that. Evelyn's not at Clouds anymore. Behavioral chip was damaged. Apparently they carted her off to a ripper dock goes by fingers. Oh shit. Know where to find this fingers character? Yeah, runs a dinky chop shop off Jig Jig Street. Fuck V. Guys, all kinds of bad news. Heading there now, to find her. I told her to stay the fuck away from clouds. Uh, all right, later, V. You know, I think I took a slightly different uh, narrative path with Judy than I've done before. I wonder if she's actually going to be there this go-round like she normally is. What's up, Johnny? Oh my, that place has a wicked vibe. So, there's more up your alley than clouds? Hey, at least here you know what you're getting. Here, Katie, Katie, what's the rush? You're fucked. Tipped you for free. Fuck off. Yeah, gear looks a little basic, but it works. So he didn't ask for any money? Nada? Not even installments? 
Like I said, he just finished and said, see you next time. Oh, Max Doc of the Wall, tell me your secrets. Might be your man. Got an issue needs sorting out. Here to do that. So how about you fuck off, let me through, and no one will be the wiser. So serious from the get-go? I was only joking. Sheesh. Fine. Let her through, Sludge. Yes, Sludge. Gentlemen. No, no, I'd, I'd rather live here. Just don't turn off the light. Summer means rain. I have to sit in the basement. Oh, gracious the whole time. creature! And, and benign! Spivinix on the elements of Europe! Us! Who the world with, with, with bloody stain imbrued! It's it for a friend, the king! Blue all we owned! The hell are they taking? I'm rare to him! Blue Blue from my base! All right! Sounds like paradise. Twenty-four hours, you feel no pain and barely remember a thing afterwards. Who can blame them then? Just needed those forceps. Fingers. Know where I can find him? If I could, I'd swap, you know? Yeah, Why does everything enough. have to be so damn convoluted? In the end, only I got left to shredded cables and empty bottles. Mm, true. Who doesn't want some delicious meat delight? your turn glad to see a familiar face I'm worried sick about her V had no idea anything had happened we'll find her I know we will hey, what's that talk about? after the heist Evelyn hold up with the mocks for a while right that's right so why the hell did she go back to clouds <laughs> thought she'd be safer there God knows why Tried to get her to see straight, but she wouldn't listen. You talked to Fingers yet? If only. He's harder to get in to see than the best docks in town. We're gonna be here forever. I just know it. Maybe you could talk to those girls, see if we can cut in front? Why me? I don't think they like me. Just give it a shot. That or come up with something better. You seen a woman with blue hair around here? Had a doll chip. Uh, think I know who you're talking about. Fingers worked on her, sure. She's still here? No idea. Gotta ask him.
Here. Saw to cover you for some real chrome. From a real ripper. If you're flush enough to afford a real reaper, then what are you doing here? Hell do you care? She's here because she feel like it. Now thank the lady unless you and me Delta. Can't see nothing but a blur. Face plates previous owner. Come on, let's go. Urges are stretching your optic nerves. Don't worry. Your eyes I think he's done. We going in? Yes? Hello. What can I do for you? Looking for a girl named Evelyn Parker. I know she was here in your... clinic. Ah, so that's what this is about. Where is she? Ah, a loaded question if I've ever heard one. You, Tiger Claws! As far as I know, I'm all paid up. We're with the mock. The Mox? Why didn't you say so? So, what brings you here? These girls know you're chipping faulty implants. You might say so. I'd say they're the very best I can find. See? What's in it for you? Whatever they have to offer. And they always have something to offer. <laughs> you're a sick fuck. Know that? Look at him. Yes, he does. Friend. <laughs> Already told you. I'm looking for a woman named Evelyn Parker. Need to know where she is. Step into my office, please. Many girls come through here. So many. But let me put it to you this way. I believe in giving each of them the personal touch. Ask anyone. I'm more than a chop doc. See, I know what people truly want. To be flattered, praised, patted. To feel like... like they deserve it. Suggest you start remembering all you can. I can't Either remember that each or and every one. Two beefers from a BD studio took her. Didn't even know their names. They mentioned a moth, of all things. Virtues with the death's head. Said she'd be good for the moth. Yeah. Need yep, that's slime ball. I'll be outside. Let me rob him real quick. Let her go back to clouds. Could have stopped her, but I didn't. Don't worry. We'll find her. I know it. We'll fucking find what's left of her butchered corpse. Hey! Keep it together! Wanna give up now? No. 
Only lead we got's an XBD. Where's that get us? We also know we're looking for something related to the Death's Head. Better than nothing. I don't get your optimism. Still sounds like a big fat nothing to me. Death's Head symbol bring anything to mind. Anything. Doesn't matter how small. This industry... I mean, market's looking for every kind of fetish out there. It's cavernous. But an XBD outfit would be on the move almost always. Makes them harder to nab, harder to sting. Mm. Fair enough. Need to figure out where they're scrolling this stuff. Gotta be a rat hole of some sort. Doubt they do much shooting on location. Yeah, gotta be somewhere quiet, out of the way. Could be we'll see something to point us in their direction in one of their virtues. Ugh, have to be real gonks to leave a clue. Everyone, everything, leaves something behind. Just need to know where to look. Lucky for me, I'm running around with the best BD specialist in town. That's an extra pair of expert eyes. Well, your BD expert has a better idea. Pleasures of Night City, a domain with its twin on the dark net. Every kind of thing goes on there. Might stumble on something useful. Let me think for a sec. Darknet domain. That's our best bet. Let's stick to the plan. Fine. Here's hoping you turn up something useful. I'll wait in the van. I gotta go find this jerk. Looking for something raw, untouched. Raw's all you get with me. Don't mind me. I'll come back some other time. Yeah. Betting on it. Looking for BDs, a particular kind. Particular? You a badge? If I was a badge, you'd already be in cuffs for what you sold the customer before me. All right, all right. Can't be too careful. What do you want? Give me the best of the best. Ones with the death's head. <sighs> Didn't know I was dealing with a connoisseur. Death's head will cost you, though. Got anything that might interest me?
pleasure doing biz with you. All right, let's find Wakako while I'm here. Kako, long time no see. So what brings you here? Have some outstanding biz to settle. Remember Sandra Dorset? I don't forget such things, V. Here is your reward. It comes with a fairly ample bonus. Go see a Ripper Doc. They'll weave you a dermal imprint that will enable smart gun compatibility. A tiger claw specialty. Willing to bet nobody knows Westbrook like you. I was saying something. Something that'll keep you wet for hours. Yo, yo, ever try rainbow poppers? Purple haze? Got every color under the sun, I do. Yeah, that'll do for now. Alright, and thanks for watching.